much about Georgia Tech's offense. I guess what have you seen with their the, the, with their defense? I mean, that triple option gets so much attention amongst the fans and everything. What about Georgia Tech's defense? Well, you know, number one, they're, they're uh, one of the top defenses we've seen this year. Um, one of the top defenses in the country. I think they're ranked 12th or 13th in the country, and um, you know, very impressive. Uh, they're playing extremely hard. Really good playmakers on that side of the ball. Their safeties are great tacklers in space, um, and uh, you know we've got our work cut out for us. They're very, very talented. Um, got some some, some uh, uh, upfront guys. They're very disruptive. Uh, really, really good pass rushers off the edge. Um, so you know, again, uh, these guys they, they, don't, they haven't played. You know, they don't play a lot of snaps in a game. Um, I think we've seen them. I think it's high snap that they played. Uh, uh, in the 70s, but uh, you know when they're out on the field, they're, they're impressive, um, and uh, they're gonna play hard. Um, Coach Reeves done, a, done a, a very good job with them. It's being his first year. Obviously, came from Auburn, um, or came from Penn State, and prior to that, he was he was uh, on the staff there at Auburn, and, and uh, so he's he's familiar with with uh, you know defending the spread because he's had to go against it. Um, so, uh, you know, they're playing hard. Um, so they've had a week off, and we've had a week off, and, and it's going to come back, you know, to, to getting out and just execute, doing what we do. You, fa you faced some good defensive ends this year, but uh, 45, does he mm – -hmm. have you faced anybody with, I guess, the s speed off the edge? The well, I, I mean, he's, he's a uh, – uh, we, we've, we've faced some guys very similar to him. Mm -hmm. Um, but he is, he's extremely quick. He's got a great up the field move and come back up underneath you. Um, does a really good job of that. Um, 93 is another really good player. 99 is a great player up front. Linebackers 11, 32. I mean, those guys really stand out. 14 in the secondary. He'll play safety. He'll play corner. He plays nickel Sam. Um, he's all over the field. And, and usually, uh, uh, you know, he, he's very similar to, to uh, number 20 from Florida State. Um, as far as tackling in space and always being around the ball, Joiner, and so uh, you know, again, those guys are, uh, you know, they're doing a good job putting these guys in, in positions to make plays, and and they're making plays in space. But um, you know, again, they've, they've done a good job. Uh, they're one of the top defenses that we've seen this year. Top one of the top defenses in the country. Um, but again, like I say, every week, and, and it doesn't change this week. It's about us. It's about us executing and doing what we do um, and getting better and building off of what we've done uh, the last two ball games um, and, and playing with some type of consistency that we've seen over the last two weeks. The running back situation with Zach being banged up, CJ getting hurt the other week, how does that affect what you guys are doing with Rod and yeah. even DJ? Well, I mean, it, it obviously affects a lot. I mean, uh, you know, Zach has worked out this past week and uh, been out there, and um, you know CJ is is, is doubtful, um, but uh, you know Hot Rod is is has been our go-to guy, um, and uh, you know DJ's played sparingly, um, and, uh, and and Zach, and we hope to have Zach back full speed and ready to go Thursday night. So should be back ready to go. You got the a long look at a lot of backups. Uh, at Virginia, did anybody make a case for more playing time in your eyes? I, you know, we, there were there were some good things. Um, by all the guys that we saw, I was very pleased with with some of our young guys and, and how they executed. Um, and, uh, and and yeah, I mean, there's there's some guys that, that uh, you know they're, they're going to get more playing time. I mean, how much more I don't know, but uh, you know they, they they did a good job. They they came in and did what they were supposed to do, and so we're very pleased with those guys. Had some, we've had some good competition in practice over the last couple of weeks, uh, and so so we'll see. You know, I think uh, you know we'd like obviously we'd like to have Isaiah Battle play play more, and and um, you know he's 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 had a, a good ten days of practice, so we'll we'll build off of that, and see how that goes Thursday night. How do you feel about a left guard right tackle? Seem like uh, those positions have just been shuffled back and forth. I mean. Well, yeah, I mean, it, it's been that way all year long, yeah. you know. <laughs> and so, uh, you know, the, just the consistency there at that position is, it, it hadn't, uh, it hadn't materialized like, like, 
like we, you know, there hadn't been one definite guy stand in and say this is this is this is um, you know this is my position, and, and we've had to rotate guys in and out, and and so uh, you know I, I don't know if we've cleared that up by all means. I think there's going to be some guys. I think that some guys have earned the right to come in and play a little bit, but uh, a little bit more. But yeah, it's, uh, it's 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 been that way all year long. It hasn't changed. You guys have uh, played on. Thursday nights before on the on the road, but it's been a long time since they've, they've had a Thursday night game here here in Clemson. Have you since maybe a little added excitement amongst your guys? Just I realize that every game is a game, but um, it is kind of neat. And it's been eleven years. Well, I, I think more so than anything, our guys are just ready to get back into action and get back on the field and and, um, and and get the month of November rolling again. Um, and so uh, you know, I'm excited to see these guys play. We've had a chance to. to kind of step back, step away from everything, and um, get some guys healthy uh, that might have been kind of bunged up over the six-week stretch that we were in. And so now that we got these guys back healthy and, and, and ready to roll for the final final three three games. Um, and so I, there is there is some extra added excitement right now. Um, number one, being a home game. There's only two of those left. And um, and two being a Thursday night game, being a primetime prime time game. So. Excited to see these guys play. Are we any closer to possibly seeing Brandon Thomas slide over the right tackle? No. <coughs> no. Nope. Nope. Okay. Thank you. How's uh, Norton Center? Is he healthy? Uh, yeah, you know he has. He's he's worked out the last. Uh, I know he he's been. Uh, I think he, you know, hurt his shoulder in the, a little bit in the Virginia game, but that's been an ongoing injury throughout the course of the year. Uh, so I think, uh, you know, he's he's kind of had a chance to get back, and, and you know, it's just something that's going to continue to plague him. It's going to continue to bother him. He just he'll work through it. He'll play through it. He's a tough kid, and uh, you know, he'll uh, you know, if he gets it's banged up, he comes out a series or so and 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 tries to get it back in place and um, get it taken care of, and he's back in there. So. But um, there's something we'll have to get taken care of at the end of the season. But everybody in the country is banged up at this point. I mean, we're not the only team that's uh, that's got injuries, and that's by all means that's not an excuse. Uh, everybody's that way at this point in time. It's 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 a mental grind right now, and um, you know what we you know we like to talk about only the strong survive. You know, the month of November, and that's that's what this month is about. Um, and um, you know, we like to think our guys are ready to go for this final three weeks, and. Uh, it starts Thursday night for a great crowd, um, and uh, you know, excited to see these guys back in action.